In this video, I will show you the wiring of Dual 3 in switch mode. As we can see, Dual 3 has 5 terminals. Connect all the neutral wires in the end on the far left. The middle two terminals are the input left wires, which are connected internally, so they are seen. First, let's connect input power. We have several neutral wires that need to be connected, but there is only one terminal on the device. So, we can connect it all the neutral wire using a terminal block. Then, pull out one wire to connect dual 3. These two output terminals can be connected to the loads. Here we take two lights as example. Similarly, connect the neutral wires to this terminal block. Finally, connect the external switch. Here are two ordinary rocker switches. Connect the rocker switch to the other terminal L in and other end of the switch to S1. S1 is used to control the relay air out 1, which corresponds to the first indicator light. S2 is used to control the relay air out 2, and the second indicator light shows the on-off status. If you need to connect another switch to control the relay 2, we need to divide the L in into two branches using a terminal block and then connect two switches respectively. Now, the operation of two switches control two lights has been to achieve two-way control, two single-pole double-through switches are needed. As we can see, there are three wiring terminals on the switch. L, L1, and L2. L is the common end of the switch, connected to dual 3. And then, the other two terminals are connected to another switch correspondingly. Finally, connect the common terminal of the switch to S1. If you want to connect another two-way switch for the second relay, as we demonstrated above, use the terminal block to divide the wire into two branches. We will no longer demonstrate here. 